Now, please, please, let me advise you. As a young man, as a young woman, grow large in your spirit. Grow very large. Give yourself to fasting. Give yourself to prayer now. You are strong in gossip instead of prayer. You are strong in the knowledge that is in your soul instead of the knowledge that is in your spirit. I wanted to be a man of knowledge. It was later that Jesus now gave me insight. The reason why I didn't allow you to go into lecture. I know how you like knowledge. But I wanted you to have the excellent knowledge. And I worship him for it till this day. If you can't call him and he responds to you, it means you don't have intimacy with him. You don't talk to him. Other things are more important to you than talking to him. I can take a walk and just discuss with him. I just stopped. And then he now begins to tell me, okay, that person you prayed for, that nothing happened. This is why. I'll go back and write it down. Because I'm a researcher. I need to build a body of truth that I can use to instruct people. See, the other one you prophesied on. And instead of the person waking up from that sick bed, the person died. Listen to me. If you can put away shame this morning, you will be helped. I said that because I see a woman with the issue of blood. You've been releasing blood. You've been releasing blood. You've been releasing blood. And God wants that fountain of blood to cease. But you see, I, I need to touch you. This one, I need to touch you. So, oh woman, if you are here, come. Make Jesus your friend. Lord, in the name of Jesus, let that fountain dry up. Dry up. Yeah, in Jesus' name. When you call him, if he, if he doesn't respond, he doesn't know your voice. You have not yet acknowledged the fact that you are totally insufficient without his help. So you have other help boosters apart from him. So you are not strong in him. The greatest investment you can do for yourself is to build that intimacy with him. Hallelujah. I don't need to go to Harvard to make millions. All I need to do is I'll just go and cry. Then he will show me one thing to invest in. That's how I, because I don't have time to struggle in the marketplace like other people. So he will just give me one insight. And I have not been able to recover from the wisdom that his voice brings. You don't need to ask me to follow the Lord. I have seen how wonderful it is. This measured Christian life that you are doing. You are just convincing yourself that it's okay. It is only the people that are ready to dive into God that will see the fullness of his possibility. Oh my God. I see. I see someone in the spirit. I see it, 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 something like a beam. But this is a beam of darkness. And the Lord shows me that you've been having strange nightmares. In fact, two nights ago, you woke up from a nightmare. It was so real. It was when you woke up, you realized that it was not in the real world. It was. Where is that person? Two nights ago, you woke up from a nightmare. Come. It was so real. So real. So real. Do you know why those things happen? Do you have an idea? Now, so, when we come for the lecture in the evening, I will show you all that things about the realm. And the way wise people pray. The way people that live long pray. There's a way they pray. There's a code they know. So that things do not just befall them by accident. Now, 
And so this is what I will do. Because there's one of you I'm trying to decode, since you are more than one now. So I'll touch you like this. Touch you like this. I'll touch you like this. I'll touch you like this. I'll touch you like this. Okay. Okay. Then I, I will do it again. I'll touch you like this again. Touch you like this. 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 And this. All right. Now, my hand, even though I've removed it, my hand is still on one of them. I've removed my hand. This is my hand. But my hand is still on one of them. And you will know in a moment which one. Father, show me that one upon whose head my hand still remains. So that's the lady I'm looking for. Now, are you there with me? Are you following me? You are not following me. This is practical. Follow me. Follow me. Now, this lady that is on the floor, there is a spirit that was worshipped in their family. And that spirit is haunting them, even though they are born again, they are Christians now. As we go in the lecture, you will find out that inheritance is a critical matter. Jesus said, I've called you to reap where you have not sown. I've called you to straw where you have not bestowed labor. The only way that is possible is by inheritance. Are you there? So inheritance is a, is a possibility in the spirit. We'll, we'll talk about inheritance for long if we have the time. So the same way you have... Are you there with me? The same way now we have access to the heritage that God was able to secure in Abraham. There are also negative inheritances that are available. There are liabilities and you need to shut them up. Don't just claim that now that you are born again, it doesn't exist. Ah. It means you are not wise. It means that you believe in the finished works of Jesus, but you don't believe in the current works of the Holy Spirit. Now, one guy was into charms and all of that. And in order for him to fortify himself, they had to dig up his sitting room, remove the tile, break the concrete, enter the ground, and plant something, and they restored it. So when he gave his life to Christ, his pastor told him, you'll be born again. That thing, he said, I have, you know, if any man be in Christ, it's a new creation. All things are past. You are in custody of the devil's thing. Okay, do you want, okay. Stay with me. Are you there? Um, I hope you know the moment you give your life to Christ, holiness is God's nature. And God is in. So why is it that people that are born again still committed immorality? Are you accessing? The reason is because they were in league with something that defiled. If we can stay, huh? are you there? That thing that they touched has the ability to defile. They stayed in that arena. That was why it was possible. So if I stay away from what can defile and I'm pressing into God, and you will see that my desire for such things will even dry up. The reason why it will dry up is because it's not sustained in Christ. Christ doesn't feed it. It's not sustained. So it's those inheritances that were responsible for the attacks that came to us whenever we get, got to the age of 21. It stopped with me because I dealt with it. My younger sisters are free. So now we want to shift this sister. I scope a lame seki up. Resco fentele. The lamos cabrisco falabria tababushe cade. Osapro of a sapisco falabais caco pelama. Do you know what you do for me? Shake me so that I can release some power on your hand. All right, so put your hand, speak in tongues, then shoot, shoot. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we cut off this open door and we shut it 
We shut it. We shut it. Access to the canvas of their minds are hereby shut in the name of Jesus. All right. Now, please, please, let me advise you. As a young man, as a young woman, grow large in your spirit. Grow very large. Give yourself to fasting. Give yourself to prayer now.